Hey, hey guys, how are you doing? It's a new week, kind of. It's Saturday. So, um, I said that I was gonna start up what we're eating again. Um, been super crazy. We still have three days until the house lists. So, we have been working on that all day today. Just basically um, clearing things off, like we're working on clearing that area up and just like I got my desk cleared off and pretty much just getting everything to where my surfaces have very minimal things on it um, because I told my realtor just putting everything away is just it's not an option for us the last time we sold our house we knew that we already had an offer in on a house and so we were comfortable just packing a lot of the things that we didn't use day to day um, but we don't know how long our house will be on the market. So we're not really comfortable doing that. So with that being said, welcome back. My name is Amanda. I have th four kids. <laughs> I got four kids ranging from 11 all the way down to 10 months. Um, I've been married to my husband for 12 and a half years. Um, no, we've been married 12. I am rain. We have been together for 12 and a half years and we have been married for 12 years. Yes, you did that math correct. We got married five months into it. So today is Saturday. Because we have been so crazy busy with all of this house stuff, we purposed that we were going to stop our work today at 7 p.m. so that we can have a movie night with the kids. We're gonna watch both Alice in Wonderlands. The first one is on Disney Plus, um, but the second one we're gonna have to rent, um, probably on Amazon Prime or something. So, um, I don't know if you guys can see it. You see the gray back there, isn't it so nice? So, I am, we had pizza over at my mom's the other night, so I had absolute, usually when we do a movie night, we do pizza. But, because we had pizza over at my mom's on Thursday, I had absolutely no desire to do pizza for movie night. So I went on my Facebook and I asked all my friends, you know, what do you guys do for movie nights? Got tons of suggestions. We decided to do hamburger sliders. So I went to the store because it was four o'clock at that point. I had procrastinated laying dinner out. So I got these, uh, these rolls and I've got um, onion rings and french fries in the oven and I've got these sliders cooking. This recipe is called the Tastiest Easiest Sliders from This Pilgrim Life. She is one of my favorite bloggers, recipe people. Um, yeah, she's just like all around my favorite. I watch her stories every day. I think she's super cool. Hi, Lisa. Uh, <laughs> Um, yeah, so this recipe is from there. I'll make sure to link that down in the description below. So I've got the sliders cooking. I'm cooking up some bacon. So my oldest son, Lucas, is one of the pickiest eaters ever. He, breakfast, he'll eat anything. He loves breakfast. Lunches, pretty picky, but a little more lenient. But dinner, dinner is where I struggle. The kid will eat like no vegetables and he will eat like very minimal dinners. So what I did tonight was I let him cook dinner with me and I let him be a part of the entire process about the burgers and I just pumped him up. I don't want him to hear me. I pumped him up about how great this was gonna be. I was like, I'm cooking bacon. And he's like, can we put my favorite cheese on there? I'm like, absolutely. So really hoping that I'll try these with ketchup and cheese and bacon. So that is what we were doing for dinner. We did not, yes, we did have breakfast. We went out to eat for breakfast this morning because we had a crazy amount of work. Braxton took me to a restaurant in town and we had breakfast. Then he went and mowed the churchyard and now he is mowing our yard. So this is the longest intro video ever. Sorry. Anywho, see you tomorrow for what we're going to eat. Hello friends, it is Monday. So didn't film yesterday because it's Sunday and we were resting. So pictures are being taken tomorrow. We're scrambling to do the last minute things like 
getting things off of tables and stuff like that, getting vacuuming done, all that kind of stuff. We did not eat breakfast. We had Subway for lunch. Was going to take a video of that, but I'm like, bleh, feeling anxious, nervous, ready, all at the same time. So main thing that needs to be done today is what I just described, which was getting things off of surfaces, cleaning floors. Um, I mean, obviously, um, I just want the floors to be clean for pictures, but um, also for showings and stuff like that. Um, I don't keep a dirty house, but I don't keep a spotless house. Um, I mean, I can usually clean up in 20 minutes before somebody comes over, that kind of thing. But like, that needs to get taken down and be taken down to the laundry and just various other things. So yeah, just, I'm a stressful person. I just, I'm naturally always kind of had a stress personality. And so, uh, yeah, these kinds of things, I stress out about it until it's done. So have no clue what we're going to eat for dinner. I am stuffed. I normally save half of my sub because they had buy two, get one free footlongs. So Braxton and I each got a foot long. We both ate both of our sandwiches and we normally don't do that. So maybe we'll just snack for dinner. I don't know. This is what I look like today. I have, oh, I'm so hot. We were just outside doing the finishing touches on the yard. Um, Braxton mowed yesterday. And then we were just like mowing around the decks and weed eating and all that kind of fun stuff. We went earlier with the kids and we like got everything out. My hair is, it's just crazy today. I'm just gonna, just gonna leave it and say this is what I feel like inside. So Emmeline, one of the things that she did today was she organized my oils by color. <laughs> And uh, we cleaned all the floors, and we've been uh, just, yeah. I think this is the cleanest my kitchen has been since we moved in. But the last thing that we need to do is we need to vacuum all the carpet, and we need to clean all of these sliding glass doors because, you know, little fingers. Yeah. We're getting there. We are getting there. We've got a uh, 20 hours. That's it. So I uh, don't know what we're gonna eat for dinner. You know what? I got a bunch of leftovers. I can do leftovers. This is this is just this is what it looks like in my head. Project. Hi. Hello. Can you wave hi? Say hi. Good job. Oh, did I turn off your TV? Did I turn off your TV? Hi. Hi, handsome boy. Oh my goodness, did I turn that off again? Oh, what are you going to do with that mama? What are you going to do with that mama? Hi, handsome. Oh, my goodness. It is not that this is an insanely dangerous hike. It's that it's an insanely dangerous hike if you don't take the right precaution. It's Tuesday, and it's almost 2 o'clock. And we had French toast for breakfast this morning. Everything is ready. Waiting on the realtor to show up, the photographer to show up, so we can sign contracts, we can take pictures, knock it all out. We have, we were done by like 11 o'clock. So we've actually just kind of been hanging out and keeping everybody confined. Thanks, I think it's fake. Take 435. Action. Hey, Chicken Nuggets, it's me, Emily. <laughs> How's it going? <laughs> Action. Hello. 
much, or can I get <laughs> three again? <laughs> yeah. Like, can I try it one more time? All right, try it one more time. Action. Hello, chicken nuggets. This is me again, Kyle. <laughs> I did it! You did it! Okay, my turn. Caleb is going to turn. Nope, Caleb's going first. Wait. Caleb! Wait. Say, hey, chicken nuggets, it's me, Caleb! <laughs> yeah. We gotta meet him in the corner. Caleb! Oh, where's the pepper Caleb going? Hey, hey chicken nuggets, it's me, Caleb! <laughs> Caleb! <laughs> you do it. Hello, hello friends, it's Wednesday. Our house is on the market, pictures are done, and yeah, so that whole thing is done. I'm hiding in the bathroom because the kids are kind of being rowdy this morning, but mission accomplished. So now I need to work on our video about our plans and why we're selling our house after we just talked about homesteading and all those kinds of things so working on that you saw um i showed a video of us at a restaurant so yesterday um pictures started at two o'clock we worked through lunch um we were cleaning up through lunch we kind of had like a little bit of a snack and then by the time we were done signing paperwork and all that it was about 4 30. So Braxton was like, let's load up, let's go get something to eat. We went to a diner in a town about 20 minutes away. We were gonna go get pizza um, at one of our favorite pizza places. Got there, said no dine-in. So we had to scramble to um, figure something else out. And so we went there and it was super good. Um, and we had a good time and um, the kids had fun and we just sat and talked and talked and talked and as we were leaving these people were like your kids are just so well behaved and you know we were like oh thank you so much and then we're like leaving again and then somebody else like grabbed my arm and they're like no really your kids are wonderful like they're a joy and then as we're walking out of the restaurant this little old lady stops us and talks about how beautiful our kids are so I had to tell the kids I'm like shrink your heads down <laughs> because they are they're really well-behaved kids we're thankful for that but they do fight and argue so with that being said it is wednesday we have not made anything to eat yet today the kids we're kind of trying a new schedule um where we're doing bible time before bed instead of in the morning so i've been doing it to where the kids can get up do their personal bible time devotions, hygiene, and then they can get like a self-serve breakfast of like oatmeal or toast or yogurt or cereal or something of that sort. So we're trying that out. We've been doing that for a couple of days. It's working pretty good. So I haven't ate anything, but the kids have served themselves something. I don't even know what. Um, and so we have friends coming over this afternoon. I'm going to work on lunch and we're going to spend this week. Um, I need to clean up the basement because the basement's um, just crazy need to get that for showings done and then start packing for florida so it's gonna be a crazy week Caleb, Caleb, <laughs> what are you doing what are you doing you crazy boy <laughs> 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 Morning, how you 
Mr. Walker. <laughs> <laughs> Caleb, I don't think that's how it's supposed to work. Let's try it this way. So quick side note, our kids love stuffed animals. Like, I hear all the time, and I was the same way. Like, I had a ton of stuffed animals as a kid, and I never played with them. Our kids, like, play with stuffed animals. Like, they give them names, and they play together and everything. And so, Evelyn has this raccoon named Miami Cooper <laughs> that she got at the Ark in Kentucky when we went with my aunt. And Caleb loves this raccoon. She just gave him to Caleb or her to Caleb and he just loves to sit and chew on her nose and she's just like the nicest sister ever that she like whenever he doesn't feel good she's like oh Caleb do you want to snuggle Miami and she gives him Miami Cooper and he just sits and plays with her you're such a sweet little puppy and you got a good big sissy huh you got a good big sissy Hey friends, so it is Friday and um, yesterday was kind of a blur. I wasn't feeling very good. We went to my mom's Wednesday night. We were going to go to a Bible study, but it stormed really, really bad on our way there. It got canceled. So we stayed the night at my mom's house and we ended up ordering Papa John's. It was good, but I felt horrible the next day. So we just got home. We did evangelism last night. And we went to a class. Hi, Caleb is just, he always just smiles at me. And so we did a class last night. We did evangelism, came home, um, woke up this morning. Um, we had a showing yesterday and we had a showing the day before. And um, yeah, so I forgot to film food yesterday. Sorry. Sorry. I'm scatterbrained. So yesterday we had Chick-fil-A for breakfast because Chick-fil-A breakfast is our favorite. Um, and then I made spaghetti at my mom's house for a late lunch, early dinner. Um, yeah. And that's what we had. So today our friends are coming over and we're going to play for a while. We're gonna work on packing for Florida. We're gonna leave in a few days. And yeah, that's what's the plan for today. So I'm gonna wrap this video up. Still working on my video with maybe Braxton. I don't know. Um, gonna work on explaining what's the next steps for our family, why we put our house up on the market, everything like that. And obviously we're going to do our trip down to Florida and all that kind of stuff. So, with that being said, um, thanks to the journey guys for being along with us. And uh, if you haven't hit subscribe, go ahead and hit subscribe. Um, and if you'd like to chat down in the comments with your Q&A questions about, um, you know, what, why we're selling the house, what are we going to do, this, that, and the other and we will work on answering those in the next video. And I will go ahead and get started a what we're eating video. And yeah, just trying to get back on schedule. So it's gonna be a crazy month around here. Um, we're going to Florida. And then when I come back, I'm gonna go see my best friend in Texas. And then when I get back, Braxton's maybe gonna go to Texas for uh, Team Patriot deployment and yeah it's just gonna and then the next week he's back to school and we're back to school and it's just crazy few weeks but that's okay after sitting at home for four months so if you're not following me on Instagram yet I'll put my handle down here it's from his bountiful blessings I post a lot of baby Kayla pictures and everyday life so we're thankful that you're here Oh, how could you not just sit and smile at the face all day long? Go ahead and follow me over there to keep in touch with me. And until next time.